sacrifice. No. Oh, okay, one guy died. I haven't even seen this I'm trying to steal that tank. No! The fucking medic! He couldn't let me continue my dreams. Nah, we could have stolen the fucking tank. I can't believe it. This fucking bozo shot it. shots from the back. We've lost Charlie, are you fucking kidding me? You know how this uh, did we actually get Charlie or just lose it? We got we had it. But no, Sorry, we just, we, I mean, we, did the enemy complete the capture? I'm not sure. Oh, I think not. There's the guys around, if you could like kill them and revive my ass. Where are you? Come on now. I'll oh, just kill everyone and let the medics oh, survive. Oh, the dangerous area. Let's see if they let me actually pick you up while I'm, there, I'm right beside them. I'm actually standing right beside them. <laughs> None of them shot at me. Guys, coming.
Ah, oh, shit, enemies behind C. Behind C? Yeah, that was one, I killed him. Okay. I hear some shit, though. People flanking C from the side. One enemy on, on the point somewhere. I think I have less than one mag left. Yeah. There's ammo in here, man. Can we just come and pick it up? It's here. Feels like they're either capping somewhere else. Yeah, they've already capped the fox shot behind us. Oh, the wall disconnected. <laughs> One's just over the hill. He's down. One I tagged just over that hill. Somebody else must have killed him though. Echo. Shot's been taken again. <laughs> I've been make tell for 50. That love. Shit. Enemy vehicle. Family. For you, it's fine. It's, there's nothing. Choice. It's all up to you, girls. But don't, don't whine and complain, let alone try to have something if you can't fully dedicate yourself to it. If you want to go and travel, you want to be the girl boss, you know. Live the sex in the city lifestyle, go do it. But don't bring a kid along. It's well, antithetical to having a kid. I, just sit down. Get those extra pills. Kids need their mothers. Didn't know if you knew. That. <laughs> no, no. You can't just outsource it to a nanny or daycare. They need you. And knowing what I know, like, children, they're, they're probably a blessing. Depending on how you raise them. And you could have the world's greatest thing in your life that most humans have had. All of them have had, because they're here. I hear a lot of shots over to the right. Raise the kid and find joy in that, or in that, or you can go have a great philosophical, educational, intelligent, sciencey, STEM-like career, whatever it is. Yeah, go go live a, an adventure. Some that that's fine too. Not both. Not both. You can. Now hold on. Go get some more pillows, ladies. 
Go get some more. You can have it all. It's just not going to be on the timeline Lying Feminist told you, which was like all at once. If you have your children early and you get married when you're the youngest and the most beautiful you are, and you attract the man. I know. I can. <laughs> Blasphemy, I know. From? Just hear me out on this theory. While you're the prettiest you are, you, oh. you you're a man. Oh my god, I almost you're killed committed. him. I can't believe I Mary tried to that not, shit. You're committed. Have your children starting at 20, 21, 22, 23. Someone revive me now? What the fuck? <clears throat> we need help at sea. You could have a lot of kids, actually. Let me kill them. Uh, and oh, I see then someone running. After, you know, whether, one, of the, one of the couple things going to happen. The older oh, yeah. kids gonna be able to watch over the younger kids, or inevitably one of these kids are gonna make it to the first grade, and then you can kind of outsource them a little bit part time. Uh, and then, after you've had your children, then you can start a career. Your late twenties, early thirties. Even when the kids are there, you know the husband takes care of them a little bit. Go we'll take some courses online. School's online. You know, Get a college degree, some kind of training online. Gradually and slowly moving towards it. <clears throat> You're 35, kids are all off in the school, older kids care younger, house is only partially burnt down once every six months, not too much chaos. Then you got a career. You're 40, you have a master's degree, and now you can have make some money. Or out of the school, he majored in step, whatever. Enjoyable life, adventure, all you want. I know, I know, right off the, you know, it's so safe. You can't touch me! You can't touch me! I'd be dependent on him if I could. Fuck me, I'm trying to pick you up. Somebody else is already picking you up. I told you how to have it all. You don't want to hear that. I want to get married, but I don't want to be dependent on a man. Well, have fun with that, sister. And by the way, thanks for abusing your children along the way. What's it called? Uh, extension. Through negligence. Through being absent. Through ignoring them. That's what teachers are for. They're to raise my children. Another thing, let me ask you, American parents, while we're on the time, I, I just find this fascinating. So, none of you raise your children, right? You don't homeschool, you don't take care of the kids, you outsource, you know, oh, they need drugs. Why are you proud of them? Regardless of what they accomplish, safe to get pick the up? performance. No, 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 no. This is my child. They're not shooting me. Oh, nothing's too good for daddy's little no, they are. You're actually proud of your children, but He's lying you didn't raise up. them. Where, where? Like the television is literally lying prone in the, in the snow. Did, and the did, and the oh shit! Did, and the nanny did. How are you proud of that? Like, for example, I know this sounds stupid. I'm proud of the retaining them because I built them. Well, so we killed kill the fucking guy. Kill the guy. <laughs> How about you kill yourself? I would be like, and look come at back that retaining wall I built. Like, you pay other people to raise your kids. They're not your kids, <laughs> essentially. So how could you be proud of your kids? No. Literally nobody thought to fucking kill the guy. Are, it's possible the kids could be raised well and turn out to be good kids. Guy must have just got like fucking. It's not likely. Parenting doesn't do too well. But just theoretically, the state were to raise a good kid, you know, teachers, guidance counselors, whatever else, not you, and they happen to raise a good kid. Hey, well, at least to attract the attention really? to that area. That's my son graduated from college. So, like, where were you for the 22 years of their life? Were you out? Were you out? Dude broing and girl bossing? Really? You didn't raise them at the all. How can you be proud? I just, yeah. just, uh, just comment section below. Please explain. If if any parents actually watch this, American parents, I'd love to see the amount. Of people. You don't understand. It takes it takes two incomes. Yeah, because you keep voting Democrat and you take forty percent of people's income away, among other reasons. Yeah, cause, cause disproportionately, but some of you guys too, you all major in dumb shit. You gotta dig yourself out of that debt, that college experience. And then, you, then the ladies, the men it's sixty percent, the women it's eighty-five percent. Your degree is completely fucking worthless. 
I don't know. And then you need an SUV and a brand new this and a brand new that. The consumerism aspect. Like, yeah, if you got rid of all that and the taxes, then you could you could actually have you could live off of one income. Oh, he'd be dependent on a man. Okay, well then you make the money and the man stays off. But then I might owe him alimony. Oh, fuck it, done. We're done. Done. Be fucking miserable for another generator. Done. Just make sure to have a lot of kids that you don't give by a, a fuck fucking about. Same medic that's make just sure sitting and, hey, at this know, fucking what? end of Charlie. Really edgy. Why don't you get divorced right when the kids are, you know, what, seven years kid and then like so seven year itch, right? What? There's a honeymoon period you'll see. There's a, so right an enemy the guy that's just at the, the our end of Charlie. Down in that's the That's when the you hit the family so with the you know what I mean be happier. Yeah, he's about to shoot me again. Fucker. It's an anti Nobel Prize in intelligence. A Nobel Prize in stupidity. American parents should get it. Alright, so there you go. Yeah, so it doesn't surprise. Yes, I'm shocked. Modern day 40 something women. That would be what? Millennial generation? Uh, they're they're upset because their their children prevented them from traveling and their careers. I mean, ho I really think about that. Holy fucking shit, man! Again, never wanted kids, but when all my different nieces and nephews were born, you're like, ah, look at this little shit! Ah, look at him! Look at him! I mean, when they're infants, they don't do much, but you know, once they one is it? That's when the fun starts. When you can start walking, recognize. Yeah, good is. Yeah. Go get in trouble, kid. Enemy. Yeah. Let's get that little booger brain of yours all coked up on sugar. Let's go, kid. We're gonna go play in puddles, kid. Let's go. How oh, you, you pass up on that you when it's, you're all fucked? You're fucking inhuman. You're fucking disgusting. Fuck you. Soulless fucking people. Alright, did I make my point? Alright. <clears throat> Let's go to the super chats, the super chats, the super chats. Let's go to the super chats and have a double drink. Uh, holy shit. Chess thoughts. 83 bucks. That's one. Thank you for the huge donation. Oh, tree 50. We're at tree 50. Some viewers right now. It'll change shortly. Yeah. Um. Why $83, though? That's kind of obscure. I, I, but if you're into chess, I'm guessing you have a very high IQ. My main concern about parenting is it sounds like a lot of guaranteed and unpaid work for decades. Right. Well, <clears throat> this goes back to the Mazel's hierarchy of needs. If you're struggling, the worst thing you could do to your life and a kid's life is have a kid. It, it, it's horrible. You're, you're going to torture yourself and your kids to it is work, which is why, again, I say wait until you can afford to have kids. For everyone who's poor, doesn't matter if you're in the ghetto, doesn't matter if you're in the trailer park, if you're a meth addict, doesn't matter. If you're... Stop having kids, Kim. That's it. That's all it is. Mm. <clears throat> everyone, black, white, Hispanic, Asians, got. Why can't you all just take a page from the the book of Asians? There, we got the book of number. Book idea, the book of Asians. So instead of the book of no, we have the book of Asians. It's just common sense bullshit about like not having kids you can't afford, majoring in STEM, all the shit I've been saying. But would it be under the brand name of the book of Asians? The only thing I've purged from that, the book of Asians. And then I'm gonna catch guff from a lot of Asians because they say, no, no, this is very necessary. But I disagree. I, there'd be no musical instruments. That's just a waste of time. No, you're not. You're not learning the cello. No, you're gonna. You're gonna do jujitsu. You're gonna. I. I'd rather have you play video games than do learn the clarinet. No, you're not. You're not doing a musical. <coughs> what was it? Um. King of the Hill. Con comes in. Stop right brain workout. Now do left brain workout. <laughs> this poor daughter just wants to be a normal kid. Halt still, das haben wir gleich. Uh, yes, it is a lot of guaranteed, unpaid work for decades. I'd say a decade if you do it right. Uh, but you get kids that love you, you get human beings that like you or respect you more. No, I, it, if you're young or especially a guy, society ain't gonna take care of you. Yeah, big risk. 
<clears throat> For girls, yeah, ladies. You're gonna have to work on the kid. Ew! Hot mommy in the club. Hot mommy in the club. Isn't there a kill the party, the gal that bumped off her kid so she could go out and party? Please choose wisely, gentlemen. Especially today. Colin K, five bucks. Life is better every year away from school. Yes! <clears throat> school is not natural. You shouldn't have to go to school. You need an education, but you shouldn't have to go to school. Rules of religion. I won't force it on my worst enemy. Yep, vasectomy on the books in a few weeks from my 29th. Good man. Good man. Yeah, if, if I had a kid, I would absolutely insist. Like, nope. Homeschooling. Um, I, I'd be okay. We'll go to kindergarten. We'll send you off there. You know, for four hours. Dad will come and drop you off. <clears throat> Dad will be here. I'll be in this room. If you want me to leave, let me know. Yeah, one more down there. You're used to hanging out with other people, being not around your parents. Okay, go socialize a little bit. I want a shit ashtray. I want a shit cigarette ashtray, even though I don't smoke. I want that. I want that. Uh, but then it's like, okay, first grade. Yeah, I got it from here. Fucking wasting my ammo on this motherfucker. Yeah, I, don't worry, I'll. I know I don't have a license. I don't have a degree in early childhood education, but I'll, I'll figure it out. This 101 IQ. Who the fuck are they? All? Ken Rose, two bucks. Thanks, Ken. Paracelsius Underact, five bucks. I want to have children. I don't want to abandon them for work. Nor have I found a mother that has intact instincts that also wouldn't abandon children. Right. You're good. Frankly, and I'm not saying this to be controversial. I'm saying it because it's just like. You know, they ran out of coal in the United Kingdom. Well, now we gotta find our coal somewhere else. Material. The material has ran out. The mines have ran dry. There is no more silver in the mine. You must go somewhere else. You're gonna have to go overseas. You will have to go overseas to where there are traditional cultures, whether that's the Middle East, a la Islam, or poorer countries, a la economics that force people to be respective of, of one another, you're gonna have to go overseas to find a traditional gal. Are they here in the United States? Yes. Very rare. So if you really want to have children, and it's tickety tock, tickety tock on your time, you, you are part of your. I'm not saying don't try here domestically, but part of your strategy is you're almost gonna have, most certainly gonna have to go overseas. Burp shy, two Australian yeah, dogs. I'm gonna dogs. start chopping off. I forgot to simulate these days. The, the STD infection is going up significantly. Very much so. It was a fascinating study when I did the research. I'm not I'm a millennial. Hmm. Although now with the Zoomers having less sex, I'm wondering what's happened to those numbers. It's a variable and moving target. Some STDs jump while others crater. It's, Spanks there's no the rhyme or it's just, I'm whoa, I, whoa. <clears throat> it looked like it was in front, now it's over. And, now, and, then that, and then out of nowhere, gonorrhea. Oh. Biscuit, two bucks, greeting Mr. Power Walker. <laughs> Thank you, Biscuit. Quadruple A. New guy, 20 generous dollars. I wrote a horror novel and named a minor character. Aaron Cleary is a wee homage to you for helping me sort out my life. It's called The Rise of Cthulhu. And free to read on Amazon. Why is complete. it free? Triple A or quadruple A? What? Why would you make it free? Don't make any. If you put work into it, don't make it free. Charge for it. Uh, thanks, Cappy, big fan. Well, thank you very much. <clears throat> Herschel for six uh, shekels. Got a 200 euro bonus for my job here. Have some. Thanks, Herschel. Hope you're doing good. Hope the weather over there is nice. Malachor five V E. 10 bucks. Stay in the most annoying old military branch for 13 years to fully retire with a pension of 45 or use cybersecurity experience to make the same amount annually but lose out on the pension and retire at 50. 13 years? Look. Okay. Alright, guys, check this out. Don't spawn. Just wait. And I will uh, fly all the in way to the 